Pakistani Taliban terminates ceasefire with government threatening attacks. Recently, Tariki Taliban Pakistan, also known as the TTP, or more commonly known just as the Pakistani Taliban, declared an end to a ceasefire agreement with the Pakistani government. The government and TTP reached a ceasefire agreement after multiple rounds of talks facilitated by the Afghan Taliban this year. After their recent announcement, the TTP commanded their fighters to carry out attacks all over the country. TTP stated that their primary reason for carrying out the attacks is the Pakistani military's increasing operations against them in the, I'm about to butcher this name, I apologize, the Khyber Pakhutunkhwa province. I'm just going to call it KP for short, okay? The KP province. <laughs> The Pakistani government or military did not comment regarding the TTP's declaration. On November 16th, the Pakistani Taliban claimed responsibility for attacking a police patrol in Lucky Marwat, southwest of Peshawar, PK's capital and largest city. Or excuse me, KP's capital and largest city. Six policemen were killed during this attack. Pakistan's Prime Minister Sh uh, Shabazz Sharif said that terrorism remains one of Pakistan's largest problems after the attack. So obviously this is very significant because this is a very fragile relationship and it seems to be going increasingly downhill. And Armin, I was wondering, like, I'm not as knowledgeable about the Pakistani Taliban but have you been following this news at all? Or what's your immediate reaction to this? Well, I mean, I just I just wonder, because, okay, so the Pakistan Taliban and the Afghanistan Taliban, they are separate, but they also, they used to be the same and they also have a lot of influence on each other. And their members just going in and out between each other as if there's no border. And the whole Taliban ideology, because it, it exists across borders of Pakistan, both sides of the borders of Pakistan, um, the it's really detrimental to the integrity of the border of Pakistan. Just Taliban just existing on both sides of these borders, right? So um, Taliban uh, coming into power in Afghanistan... Um, and a lot of Pakistani intelligence and officials supporting that was, is completely in counter to the interest of Pakistan's border, border integrity, right? Because that shows that a lot of the things that happens in the Pakistan's intelligence and also military is uh, ideological, in line with ideological interests rather than pro-Pakistan, right? Um, and... That support for Taliban has also led, and I don't know, maybe Harris could correct me in the chat, has motivated, encouraged, and mobilized the Pakistan, uh, the Taliban on the other side of the border, which is in Pakistan, which is now becoming a major hassle for Pakistan itself, which shows you how bad of an idea it was for Pakistan to be this much in support for Taliban in Afghanistan. Uh, I don't know if there is much of a relationship here or if that the, the causation is as one-to-one -one as I'm suggesting here. So let me see uh, what uh, I'm going to read a couple of comments by maybe D and Harris. So we could like, you want to read these as I, as I start them? Yeah. Harris is saying it's going to be interesting. Pakistani intellectuals are calling on the Pakistan army to smoke the bastards. It's going to be fun. Yeah. So this is like, this is the, um, chickens coming home kind of to situation. Yeah, yeah, for, yeah. Yeah, um, Dia saying, being a policeman in Pakistan is very dangerous. They are targets. Yeah, let's read this one as well. Harris is also saying the Pakistani yes. Talibans are the same as the Afghan Taliban Talibs with the same ideological goal, but they, sponsor, but they are sponsored by the Afghan Talibs. See, this is exactly what I was just saying. So I was correct, okay? Um, and I think like the t the extra motivation and mobilization and power that they're getting in Pakistan is because of the what's happening in Afghanistan. So it was mm -hmm. so dumb. That's why it was just so idiotic of Pakistan to be so much in support of the Taliban in Afghanistan. Like this is completely backfiring for the 10th time, by the way. Like Pakistan has been 
um, supporting the Taliban and funding them ever since its in inception. Mm -hmm. And it keeps on all these different radical groups are destroying Pakistan. Um, and they're coming out against the very hand that fed them all the time. And Pakistan the continues to do it. And doesn't, yeah. yeah, it never learns from it. It continues to do that. I don't understand. Like, they, are they, this is a suicidal government. Um, yeah, Pakistan, Pakistan is so Or they're so, unstable. like, virulently anti-India that will do anything to try to destabilize India to its own detriment. Yeah, that, like that's they, where a lot of these things come from. Well, I'm thinking specifically of Lashkar Taiba, but yeah, it's kind of like Pakistan and India are in the same room, okay? And Pakistan hates India so much that it drops a gas bomb right in the room, which he himself is in, just because it's going to hurt India. Like, you're killing yourself. I like, I know I'm dying here from this gas bomb that I dropped, but I think India is going to get hurt by it a little bit as well, so it's fine. Like, in in English, we would say you're. We would say that you're cutting off your nose to spite your face. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, people are saying okay. Oh, here, let's read this one. Horace is saying no, Armin. They don't like the Pakistani Talibs. They support the Afghan Talibs because they are anti-India. However, That's what I'm saying. Okay. No, no, no. Talibs go back. Go back. Hold on, just a second. Why are you? Why are you not letting me respond? Okay. This is ex no, Armin. And then he repeats exactly what I said. I said they support the Afghan Taliban, which has mobilized and encouraged and prompted the Pakistan because the Pak I didn't say they directly when Taliban was invading all of Afghanistan, uh, Pakistan came, Pakistan's army came in support of and the intelligence came in support of that Taliban, which then eventually led to a mobilization and funding and encouragement of the Taliban in Pakistan. Of course, the Taliban. The Pakistan doesn't come directly fund or support a ta the Taliban inside Pakistan, which is an insurgence movement. Like, why would they do that? They're, the Taliban in Pakistan is in direct opposition to openly in opposition to the government there. They wouldn't fu they, they wouldn't fund that, but they would fund their sister organization, which they see eye to eye with, as if their border is going to stop anything. They the Taliban's across the border they don't recognize the border so it's not like oh yeah that's just the taliban in afghanistan they're they're the same thing so supporting one of them on one side of the border is going to it's going to bleed into the other side of the border yeah but go on next one <laughs> horace then says the afghan talibs have evolved now and they realize that the pakistanis are double crossing them too so are about to give the Pakistanis some payback. And then he says, mm. calm down, Armin. I'm typing, no. you're speaking. I can't go back and undo my comment. Chill, man. <laughs> I will never chill. People who tell me to calm down do not know me. I don't understand why Harris is telling me to calm down. Have you met me, Harris? Yes. Chill? I am the enemy of chill. So no, Trust. I will not chill. I will not chill. I've seen you guys going at it in person. It's hilarious. Yes. Suha is saying, fight, 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 fight. <laughs> Suha, why? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Let me. Oh, oh my God. He's being call. defensive of me. He's saying, don't yell at her arm. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my, uh, awesome, my king. Wait, I want to show. I want to show Gossam something. This is a little joke for just the two of us. No, I don't like this joke. I know what joke you're gonna make. I don't like it. But go. On. Okay, okay. I will just say for Gossam. I think Gossam will enjoy that for lunch. Babak made me some Gossam Soli money. <laughs> I joke. I like that joke. You laughed earlier. Don't lie. <laughs> You guys, <laughs> I mean, I can expect that from a Catholic who, ex-Catholic who literally eats their God. But anyways, <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> Get my best-selling book, Why There Is No God, for free. Click on the link for it in the description.